Oh no! Oh, hit! <laughs> hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil, and welcome back to Beam in G Drive. In today's episode, we are going to be revisiting one of the best scenario mods ever released for Beam and G Drive because it has been updated. I, of course. I'm talking about the car games. If you don't know what car games is, highly recommend you check out one of my older videos on this thing because it's basically just a bunch of car sporting events like long jumping, darts, um, and stuff like that. There's even some curling in there and billiards, like pool and stuff like that. It's really awesome and it has been updated and now there's just kind of a car hub and this is how you access all of the different games, I guess, which is really pretty freaking cool. But if you guys have any other scenarios that you'd like me to check out, let me know down below in those comments. And while you're down there, why don't you go ahead and leave a like on this video to show your support because I don't know why. It just it, it helps me out. Just just know that it helps me out. Anyway, let's get into the hub world and uh, start our car games adventure, shall we? Alrighty, and we are in. And this already is a lot different than the last time that I did this. So it says theme one forest. Now there is pretty much the same... Uh, events only with different themes right now. We only have the forest available to us, but we have the tech uh, What's that one say space? planets and It says industrial so yeah, I'll probably only be doing the first one maybe the second one in this video But if there is enough interest for a part two or part three, let me know down below Alrighty, so we're gonna make our way over to the forest theme and I guess that we will just start from left to right. It's been a while since I've uh, done these, so I don't exactly remember all of them, but I believe the first one is car darts. All right, so launch your car off the, yeah, okay. You, you guys know how darts work. You aim for the middle. You jump off the cliff and aim as close as you can to the middle. Pretty simple. Whoa. <laughs> we got some special effects there. That's actually pretty cool. All right, so that is really awesome because from that one hub world, now you can just do all of these uh, scenarios all from that one scenario. They all stem off from that one scenario. It's almost like a campaign mode Only it's under the disguise of a scenario. I don't know how that works I'm not gonna pretend to know how that works, but it is awesome. Anyway, let's do this guys. We got the Gavril D series Let's see if we can do this. I don't think I've ever gotten <laughs> a Perfect score on here. So I don't think I need to go that fast I don't want to go too fast because I don't want to overshoot it, but I think I just missed Oh, wait, maybe not. Uh-oh. <gasps> oh! That was actually pretty good. What did we get? What did we get? Come on, show me the money. We got a uh, 89 out of 100, 94 out of 100. Not bad. Not bad. Go is that a gold or uh, I can't tell. I think that's a gold. Anyway, uh, you've stolen the show with your performance. Your score, 184. You achieved diamond. Next metal. Okay, I can't do any better than that. So <laughs> I think diamond. Yeah, there's no next metal. All right. I think we did pretty good though. If I click on next scenario, is it just going to take me right into the next game? I hope so. I mean, the hub world's cool and all, but uh, yeah, I, I, I want to go through these just so I can reminisce on how awesome they are because they really are awesome. All right, sweet. It took us straight into car curling. This is actually one of my favorites. Uh, scare, scare, uh bleh, steer your car into a scoreboard and score as many points as possible. Orange cars contribute to your overall score. All righty. Let's do it. Now, if I remember correctly, at a certain point, you lose control over your car. So you have to get it positioned just right before you actually get there. So you want to aim for the red car. We want to push the red car out of this. So here we go. Hopefully this works. Come on. We just got to knock that pigeon into next. Oh, wait, what? Okay, we can still turn it. Oh, God. Oh! <laughs> Whoops. I think I may have knocked uh, one of my cars into the blue, though. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go way outside, though. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, that was pretty bad. Pretty bad. Well, we got a silver. Should I retry that one? I feel like I should retry that one, just for the heck of it. Maybe I should slow down a little bit. I mean... Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know how to do this. I, I, I actually, I think I got to hit the pigeon and then immediately turn my car to the right. So let's try it this way. I'm going to slow down, slow down just a little bit, just a little bit here. 
And hit the pigeon. Ooh. Get the pigeon out of here. I don't want him anywhere near that blue. Oh, wow. That was awful. <laughs> Maybe I just don't, don't know how curling works, but that seemed pretty pitiful. Yeah, I achieved a none. Wow. Wow. Okay, I guess I'll do it once more. I don't know why. I, I mean, this is fun, though. I don't know why. It's just fun to just run into cars. I mean, that's actually a pretty basic principle of BMG Drive. It's always fun to run into cars in BMG Drive. Let's try a little bit different approach here. Maybe I'll run into both of the cars. Wait. Can I put on my handbrake? No, I can't. Oh! Is that going to slow me down enough? Man! Okay, you know what? Maybe I should run into my own cars. I mean, that makes sense, right? Wait, I can block them off. No, you're not going anywhere. Wow. Okay, yeah, we got a bronze that time. This. Okay, I'm going to do it one more time. I'm, I'm sorry. I got to do it one more time. Now I'm just going to run straight into my cars. And hopefully... Actually, you know what? Maybe I can... Maybe I can hit this car on the right-hand side into our own cars, and then they're not going to go too far, but it'll knock the pigeon out of the race. I don't know, actually. Hold on. Oh, we might be going too fast. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. 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 Wait, wait, wait. Get that orange car in the blue, baby. Yeah. Nope. I'm, I'm way out here in the orange. Dang it. Wow. Okay, that was terrible. All right, we're going to move on. We'll have to come back to that someday, maybe on a stream or something, and try that again because that was awful. But we did pretty good the first try. I think we just got lucky, though. All righty. Here we have the, uh, the billiards, the pool. Uh, Q game. So drive into the formation of balls and pot as many as you can. You'll have 90 seconds to pot as many balls as you can. If you pot yourself in a pocket, it will be considered a foul shot and thus you will be disqualified. 100 points is awarded for every ball potted. Okay. Okay. So if we get, um, if we get 1,000, we can actually beat the dev out, which would be kind of awesome. I doubt it's going to happen because I have terrible control uh, in this game over vehicles, but we're going to try anyway. Let's see if we can get a couple right here. Whoop! Uh oh. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh, uh, there's two right there. Heck yeah. All right. Let's go for another one. This one's pretty close. Boom! Nice. That's probably in, I hope. Let's see if we can get this one in. I like how they, even the balls have soft body physics. Yeah. There we go. There we go. Here's one that's pretty close. Let's see if we can. Shoot it! Oh, that might be a little bit too far to the left here. Let's just, let's just go ahead and tap it in. There we go. All right, so what are we at? 600 or 500. So we need to get 800 if we want to get the diamond. Shouldn't be too hard. I think those two are going in. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! All right, we're doing pretty good. Let's see if we can get one of these. Eh! Ooh, that might be too bad. Too bad, too bad. Come on, come on, come on. I want to beat the dev out. All right, we need to get two more to beat the dev. I, I think we can do it. Let's just shoot this one a little bit to the left. That's got to be in. Oh, yeah. All right. We got one more. I think, I, I think I'm think i going to actually get the same score as the dev because there's no more balls. Can I get some more balls up in here? Come on. There we go. <laughs> Diamond. We did the same as the dev. That's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Not that hard, really. If you have a... I mean... I mean, if you if you played pool before, you should be good at it. It's it's not that bad actually. I I, I feel accomplished now after the disaster that was uh, that was curling, threading the needle. All right, so it says pre precision is everything. I actually don't remember this one. It's an obstacle course though. Oh buddy, I love me some beam and G obstacle courses. All right, complete the obstacle course ahead while passing through targets. Passing through the center of the target gives the most points. All right, I think I got it. We got an off-road truck, so we should be set because I imagine we're going to do, be doing quite a few jumps here. Now, I don't think speed is a factor, so we can just worry about ooh, getting the perfect scores here. Right through the green. There we go. There we go. And I guess we'll go this way because my car kind of bounced that way, so we're just going to roll with it. Hopefully, we're not doing too much damage to this D-Series. I mean, these are pretty rough jumps, though, not going to lie. Oh, God. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. We're okay. Ooh, almost missed that one. I think we got it, though. Oh, God. Yep, something's broken. Something is indeed broken. We're going to be okay, though. There's the finish line, I think. Is this the finish line? Yes, it is. We got 270. Not bad. You still in the show with your performance. 286. You achieved diamond status. Two diamonds in a row. Not bad. Not bad at all. Here we go. 
and our car is thoroughly ruined, but we got the diamond, so, you know, I, I'm I'm happy as heck. There was, It was timing us, by the way. We only got 16 out of 25 for time, but uh, the targets, we got 270 out of 320. I feel like I went through all, mo the middle of most of them. There's only one that I really kind of messed up. I guess I got deducted for that, actually. All right, anyway, here we are, airborne terminal velocity. Uh, last bit of this theme, so let's see how good you are at high speed. So this is basically a long jump, only he's thrown in. A few blocks for me to run head in, head on into, if I do so, please. Now, I don't really want to, because I want to see how far I can go. What's my target? 250? All right. All right. I feel like we can beat that. This is a fast car, an SRB4. So as long as we just kind of weave through these, I think we can actually hit the end of that ramp at a pretty high rate of speed. There we go. 215 miles an hour. Holy crap. All right, we are already past the 400 meter mark. Past the 500, 600. Yes. Oh man, 613. Diamond achieved. And it only went up to 640. What if I would have got like 700? Then what would have happened? I don't know. Anyway, we beat it. So let's go back to the home world and try out the second theme and see if it throws any in any twists for us. Because I remember... There was a few times when it would kind of mess with the uh, the billiard theme, specifically. So, no, no, no. Whoa. Okay. Uh. Okay. Okay. I thought I was accidentally clicking on that. So now, the uh, second one is unlocked. Where is it? Is it the, f the? No, that's theme one. So where is theme two? There it is. And this is the tech one. So it's gonna be very uh, futuristic, I imagine. But it is the same events but just with a different locale. So let's just do a couple before this video is up and see if there's anything different here. But for now, let's just go back to card arts. Let's do it. Oh yeah, look at that. We got multipliers now. Okay. Okay, so it might be better if we actually land on the times four. Not a, not necessarily aiming for the, the middle of the target there. So we might actually want to throw ourselves a little bit to the right. And then maybe... We can get that times four. Oh, wait. Uh-oh. <laughs> Overshot it a little bit. We got the times two, but I think we, I don't think we can actually get the times two and the times four at the same time. So you know what? I'm just going to go big or go home. I'm going to aim straight for the times four here. Now the times two isn't there. That's strange. Can I not get it again? If I get it once, I can't get it again? I guess not. Oh, I overshot it again, didn't I? Yeah, I did. All right, let's, let's try that again. I got I to gotta go a little bit slower here. A little bit. Just a little bit. Because uh, even little differences like that are going to cause like a huge drastic change in how far you actually go here. There we go. There we go. Is that not far enough now? Oh! Okay, so the speed was good, but I went a little bit too far to the right there. All right, I think I got it this time. I think... I got it. So, slow down right around here. There we go. That is looking good. Come on, baby. Come on. Yes! There we go. Times four. We landed in the yellow, though, so I don't know how that's going to actually affect my score here. We got the gold, though. 564 points. Not bad, but if we want to get the platinum, we got to get the 800. But for now, I'm just going to go on to the next scenario. Again, if you guys want to see more of this, uh, you want to see me finish out the entire series? Go for platinum on every single one. Uh, let me know down below in those comments, and I, I'll do it. Trucking along. All right, so, yeah, it's definitely a little bit different here. Ooh. Ooh, 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 I remember this. If you get the truck, then, like, a truck will come and plow everybody out of the way. Oh, my God, I forgot about this. All right, let's try it. Let's try it. I might actually just have to do this anyway, guys. Because I might have to, to finish this anyway. Because there, I, I don't know what he's changed. This looks completely different. Here, let's go for this, though. And let's see if we can knock our own guy into the pigeon. Knock him out of the blue. Ooh. And let's try to get the truck. Come on. I need me some truck here, baby. There we go. Oh, my God. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Here he comes. Let's go for this times two. Oh, no. Oh, he hit. 
<laughs> yeah, he, he hit my guy. Well, that didn't work. At least I kind of know where he's going to be this time. So, I think I can actually do this, maybe. Um, so, you know what? I'm just going to smack this guy right here. This red guy, knock him way out of the way. And boom! Nice. That's actually not what I was trying to do. But let's see if we can still get that truck. Come on. Come on. Somebody get the truck. I need it. All right. Keep it going. Keep it going. There's the times four. There's the times four. Come on. Go. No. I wasn't fast enough. All right. Let's try that once more. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Get it. Get it. Get it. Come on. Yeah. No. <laughs> Dang it. All right. I'm going to try it one more time. I'm going to try it one more time. Maybe I should just straight up aim for that red guy right in the middle. Or maybe I can go for the times two. No, no, no. I don't, have, I don't have enough time. Let's just go right here. We'll kind of bounce off this red guy right here. Ooh, knock this guy into oblivion. Yeah. And then go for the times eight over here. Come on. There it is. Now we need to not get deaded by the uh, the truck guy. All right, so where is he? Let's try to get back on the board here. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh! <laughs> Absolutely annihilated the pigeon, dragging him way off the board. What? I didn't get any score. I was on the board. Oh, you know what? Screw you, game. Maybe I'm just terrible at, at, at curling. I don't know. We'll, we'll definitely have to try that again sometime soon, though. All righty, guys. So that's going to do it for this episode of Beam NG Drive Car Games. Seriously, a lot of fun. And I'm so glad that the dev is still adding to this thing. It's a behemoth. It's, an, it's a game within a game, basically. It, it, it's, it's almost like a flat-out mini games. is kind of what I would compare it to. Anyway, it's awesome. Definitely something you got to check out. If you have BMG Drive, I will have the link down below. Make sure to check it out. And make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And join my Discord if you have any suggestions. You can uh, go there and uh, leave your suggestions in the suggestion tab. And, uh, yeah, that's going to about do it. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See ya.